There have been thousands of exoplanets found in our universe, each with their own unique features. This search has led to the discovery of many fascinating worlds that showed astronomers how unexpected the universe can be. What have astronomers found in their hunt for exoplanets? You're watching Matter, and today we're looking at 10 recent planet discoveries that will freak you out. Located in the Whirlpool Galaxy about 28 million light years away, this exoplanet was found by looking for dips in the brightness of the X-rays emitted by the stars in this galaxy. Named M51 ULS-1b, this planet is potentially sized similarly to Saturn, and not only orbits a star, but it appears that it also orbits a secondary super-dense object that could be a black hole or neutron star about twice the distance that Saturn orbits the Sun. How many exoplanets are out there among the galaxies that are beyond our current capabilities to detect? Earth went through a period called its snowball Earth phase in which huge icy oceans developed across the planet and major glaciation takes place and covers the planet in ice. While searching for exoplanets, astronomers have recently found that exoplanets going through a snowball Earth phase may be quite more common than originally thought. In some of these cases, the exoplanets become tidally locked with their stars, during which one side of the planet will always be facing the star. This type of orbit seems to induce a snowball Earth phase on these exoplanets in which one side develops that face into an eyeball-like icy ocean. The hope is that more can be understood about the life and growth of our own planet by finding exoplanets exhibiting behavior that scientists expect the Earth went through as well. What can we learn about our planet by studying more snowball Earths out in space? A red dwarf star known as Tea Garden Star was found only a short 12 and a half light years from the Sun with two Earth-like exoplanets in orbit. These newly found worlds orbit their star extremely fast, with one completing its orbit in just under five days, while the other's orbital period is around 11 and a half days. They orbit this fast due to how close they are to their host star. But because this star burns much weaker than our sun, the planets are still within its habitable zone. This means liquid water can exist on the surface of these planets, which means there may be life here as well. Could two Earth-like planets in the same star system increase the likelihood of finding life there? Just last year, astronomers using NASA's Transiting Exoplanet Survey Satellite, abbreviated TESS, found an exoplanet that orbits its home star every 16 hours, located in the Hercules constellation nearly 855 light-years away from Earth. Named TOI-2109b, this exoplanet is a gas giant that has been called a hot Jupiter. The surface of this exoplanet reaches over 3,000 degrees Celsius due to the massive amounts of light and radiation that blast the surface, which is also exacerbated by its tidal orbit with one side always facing the star. Can you imagine having an entire year last only 16 hours and having a new season every four? Number six, a planet that has regrown its atmosphere. In an event that has never been seen or observed before, astronomers may have found an exoplanet that not only lost its atmosphere in the distant past, it also created a new one. Known as GJ1132b, this exoplanet is only 41 light years from Earth and orbits its red dwarf star once every one and a half days on Earth. When looking at the composition of the atmosphere of this planet, astronomers were able to learn that the current atmosphere was not there when the planet originally formed. The newer atmosphere may have been created when the molten rock on the planet's surface released gas that condensed around the surface. Could other planets be able to regrow their atmospheres as well? We all know that the Earth is a sphere, like most objects that we encounter out in the cosmos, but this is not a steadfast rule. Many asteroids and comets are elongated and even planets can become misshapen. In 2019, astronomers found another hot Jupiter exoplanet that was football-shaped, which they call WASP-121b, 
It orbits its star extremely close, and as a consequence, it is currently stripping the planet of its atmosphere and its heavy metals. The distance to the star causes the surface to reach a scorching 2600 degrees Celsius around its upper atmosphere. In addition to this, the star's gravity causes the planet to bulge into a football-like shape as it gets closer to tearing the exoplanet apart. Number 4. A gaseous giant found with two stars Another discovery that TESS was able to make came in March of 2019 when it discovered a preteen gaseous exoplanet in an interesting arrangement. A new planet, thought to be just 43 million years old, called DS Tuck AB, exists in a binary star system but only orbits one of the two. Studying this planet further can lead us to a much better understanding of the growth of planets in their early years. To put in perspective how young this planet is, the Earth is over 100 times older than this exoplanet. What might astronomers learn by studying this young world? Number 3. Planets can orbit black holes Nearly all of the planets and exoplanets, minus the isolated rogue ones that have been found, were located within a star system. But new research and computer models are showing that planets may exist that orbit a far more dangerous object, a black hole. The computer models have taught scientists that it is possible for a Neptune-like planet to form in an area around a supermassive black hole and begin to orbit around it. These exoplanets would not be nearly as close to the black hole as they would be to a star. The estimates are showing that the orbital distance may be between 10 and 30 light years away from the event horizon of the black hole and the clouds of dust and debris that gather due to the black hole's immense gravitational pull. The exoplanets will be composed mostly of icy dust that orbit in massive clouds around the supermassive black holes in our universe. Scientists believe that there could be tens of thousands of planets orbiting black holes throughout the universe. But until more powerful telescopes are built and they are able to take a closer look at these possible planets, it will continue to be just a theory. The search for extraterrestrial life in the universe has been going on for most of the space age. One way that astronomers are taking on this mission is by searching the cosmos for exoplanets that show signs that they contain water. A new exoplanet in the LEO constellation called K218b has been found and water vapor has been confirmed to exist in its atmosphere only 124 light years from Earth. While this planet most likely lacks a solid surface, the discovery of water vapor on a planet within the habitable zone of a star has refueled many scientists in their search for exoplanets with water. As well, finding this close of a planet with water has helped astronomers form a better understanding of the formation of planets in the habitable zones of stars. Could planets with water be more common than astronomers had anticipated? Number 1. Super Earths on our Cosmic Doorstep Astronomers have found many exoplanets so far, but are any of these exoplanets suitable for life? While there is only one Earth that we know of, a certain class of exoplanets found called super-Earths typically have at least twice the mass of Earth while being smaller than the ice giants of our solar system like Uranus and Neptune. One of these super-Earths found goes by the name Gliese 581c and measures at least 5.5 times the mass of our Earth and is located in our cosmic neighborhood at just over 20 light-years away. While this planet is probably not habitable right now due to its atmosphere, the surface temperature on this planet is within the range to allow liquid water to form on its surface. Do you think the search for exoplanets will lead us to finding humanity's second home? Thanks for watching. See you next time on Matter.